if he would will here. Every full moon, Pusha Shoshana ni itaka yata ona no ota to Pushka we at Tatara Shemania. It is Monday, Memorial Day. She had no day of the week it is. Niho kunano tatanana awatati shishishana ni itaki atanana huta to Pusha Shaya tanana ni itaka. The 28th of May 2018. And the moon is up and the sun is down. So if we pivot, I am on Mount Rainier, and if we pivot over to the west, the sun is already down and the sun is in Taurus, right next to Aldebaran. Let me place the tripod back down. And that's where we were. Let me adjust again. Niko oro na hasa sara. Now that it moved. Nika ariya to oro no hota toshia. And the moon is to the east. And the moon is near Antares. And the moon has moved into Scorpio since earlier today. From Libra, and uh, we shall see where it gets to tomorrow morning when it's at its apex. The moon is beyond that little mound that's almost centered. I wanted to get more of the Nisqually River. Oh good, we're good. But we don't have The mountain. There we go. We're back to the... And there are still some clouds up, so even if the moon does come up, it'll be hard to uh, hard to see her, our grandmother moon. Oh, and I give honor. To Grandmother Moon, no ota to no no ota to chishishaya kena na ota isa na na hatiya. For the moon represents the divine feminine. Nihi ota ta anun ota to kushishama na nihi chishishkawa yata ta. The essence of allow in the sun represents the action. Nihi ota ko ona na ota to kushikawa yasa society ata na na ota to kushiyata. The moon represents the wisdom. And the sun represents the understanding. And when we celebrate the cycles of the moon, we celebrate the cycles of life. And just like with our breath, the cycles of our breath, when we had a full set of lungs, just like the full moon, the only thing left to do is to exhale and release all that carbon dioxide which no longer serves us. And that is what we do when we celebrate a full moon. And this is no ordinary full moon. This is a full moon. Nahi shishawa awa kawana no uta to to no hara shisha. In Scorpio, no uta to shisha na na awa kahesane i ta tai ta na na ata to kushisha ka shishisha ne i to ora no hoa to poa. 
According to the star maps, it's in the Scorpio. And some clouds are moving in pretty fast. And some of the clouds that are overhead, over the mountain, are sitting still. And we are in Lunation. Lunation. We are the nation of Luna. The mother goddess, the moon goddess, of 1180, where we are the master manifestors with the unlimited nature. So I invite and allow the holy fire to flow in through and around us all in every way and everywhere and every when. No o taya takanana aihi atichawa tenana ukuhu tata itata shishaya kunanawari atata sarani atata shiawe atata. And I ask you to engage in allowing the release, just to simply let it go. Whatever no longer serves. To make space for the new. Just turn it over entirely to the Holy Fire. And it will release it in the most natural way possible. And in Lunation, Luna Nation 1180, we are in alignment. We're in alignment with the four royal stars <clears throat> at sunset and at sunrise. And at high noon and at midnight. At sunrise, we are in alignment as it was on sunrise in the age of Taurus 6,000 years ago. At sunrise on the vernal equinox. With Aldebaran meeting the sun at sunrise. The fiery left eye of the bull. Well, from the bull's perspective, it's the right eye. And Aldebaran is called the follower. Because Aldebaran follows the Pleiades. And to the west at sunrise, 6,000 years ago, on the vernal equinox, to the west was Antares in Scorpio. The heart of the scorpion. And the bull is the earth energy. And Scorpio is the water energy. And to the north, 6,000 years ago at sunrise, 
We had from El Hawk, which is the Guardian of the North, which is close to Aquarius. This is at the foot of Aquarius. It is in the southern big fish. And that fish was responsible for drinking all the water poured out by the water bearer. So that the earth did not drown in the deluge, in the great deluge. And to the south at noon was Regulus, the heart of the lion in Leo. The watcher of the south. And so at sunset today, the alignment is reversed. Aldebaran is in the west. And Antares is in the east. Because the earth is rotated to sunset. So at sunset today, when the moon rises in the east, we shall give honor to the moon goddess. Who governs the yin, who governs the darkness, who shines the light in the darkness. And with the heart of the scorpion. She exacts justice righteously and with mercy. She nurtures, she is loving. And if I move to the south, we'll get a little more light. Let me set that back down and readjust. While we finish up strong. We're pointing to the south and we're pointing to the west. But as I face the east, I greet Grandmother Moon. And in the clouds, I'm going to show you. All the shimmering in the clouds is her bright light. But since this is a video, I'll go back to the south for the light. So Grandmother Moon, no otakushki we atatata. I honor you. And I allow you to flow in through and around me in every way and everywhere and everywhere along with the Holy Spirit. And along with the four archangels, the four watchers, Michael in El Dabaran, and going clockwise too. We go to the north. Om Alha and and uh, Archangel Uriel. And to the east. At sunset, no ototashia tananayatata is Antari, is Niyatokono no hototor, Shishkawal Pieta, it is Archangel 
Raphael, na arintukona na hota orsha shishkawa tete sini yetetere, and then to the sral ni tukona na hota tere Regulus and Archangel Gabriel. Na arintukona na hota tar shar shakana na haya aya ta ana no uta tukona no uta tukushke we have to stop. Write down what you wish to create. This is an epic lunation. No ota takara ni yetata. It's an epic full moon to release whatever no longer serves. No hoya ka awarana har skana ni shishishkona no hoto toro shika. Unlimit yourselves, my friends. No ho sasana na ayetata na atiti shishikawara no ho atatara. Isa sasana na atakai shishikana no uko ho ata. Aara na hai sasisikini na ato tukushka. We ana na hari yetapusko no ho atisha. Ka ayetana no hari yetatana naskaraya. And Venus is in Cancer, by the way. No or shishishkawar na yetata resanati at kananahuta or shishikawar yetata. All right, my friends. Unlimit yourselves. Manifest. Write it down. Celebrate. Be awesome. Namaste.